back to school and back to the kitchen. When students learned from home, they had access to a full fridge during the day. Not anymore, though. Parents are once again packing lunches for their kids. There needs to be great care taken in how nutritious these meals are and making sure that it's more than adequate to support growth and development. Sandwiches are a classic lunch item, but Adventist Health Senior Director of Nutrition Angela Newton says consider mixing them up. Try a whole wheat tortilla or pita pocket and load on the veggies going beyond typical lettuce and tomato. Make it interesting. We want to increase the maximum levels of antioxidants. Make it bright and colorful. Use things like zucchini or carrots. Also, don't forget about leftovers. We do want to decrease our carbon footprint. So if you've already made something last night, go ahead and incorporate it into what you're going to do for lunch the next day. And it's all right to play with your food. Newton says things kids can dunk and dip are easy, fun snacks. They want their hands and their fingers on everything. I remember when I was young, my mother was like, stop touching that. <laughs> things like guacamole, using avocados, which are very high in, in good fats, um, very flavorful, things that they've already manipulated and then they get to dunk, it's just all good. And include children in the process. Newton says they're more likely to eat their lunch when they help pack it. So involve them, invite them in, help them to put their hands on and participate in what's happening in the kitchen. Fueling kids up for a fun, successful and healthy school year.